Han. Young Han. Spell Young. Uh, Y-O-U-N-G. Okay. Mm-hmm. Young Han, who says, Mr. Tyson, I love your work and your show. Can you talk about the Silurian hypothesis and how it impacts how we should view our own species, civilizations, and specialness, or lack thereof, here on Earth? If advanced civilization is so fleeting and difficult to detect in our own fossil record, is it going to be easier or harder to detect in space? Hmm. Wouldn't it be fun Mm -hmm. if we were just the nth intelligent civilization to rise up on planet Earth? Or even the nth civilization of humans that had rose up and destroyed destroyed themselves and rose up again multiple times. Right. So you'd think, I think, we would see a record of this somewhere somewhere in the fossils. Right. You'd think. Right. There'd be a Statue of Liberty sticking out of the ground. Damn you! <laughs> Damn you all the hell, you apes! You. <laughs> There'd be, I mean, that, that's an example of a, of right. a Silurian, of Silurian. A, a, okay. a civilization right. that predated the, the planet of the apes, because that was Earth. Right. Okay, it seems to me we would find a record of it. But if we find bones, we find other fossilized artifacts of dinosaurs from 65 million years ago. Right. Then, and by the way, the biggest mammals of the day were these tiny little rodents yeah. running underfoot trying to not get eaten by T-Rex as hors d'oeuvres. Yeah. Okay, so you can't presume that would that there were big brain mammals before that, because that was the origin of the mammals on Earth. Right. Around that around time. Around that time, right. right. Is there a possibility that the civilization before us were not mammalian. Okay, so uh, I haven't seen any like dinosaur casinos or anything <laughs> left over. <laughs> no, I mean, just you would see things. Right. And we're not that, we're not ignorant not of yet. the history of what happened in Earth's crust. Here's where you'd have a problem. Go ahead. You can ask the question, what is the time scale for all of Earth's crust to get subducted back down and come out in a volcano. Oh, because that no, would destroy that, that, all that, evidence. Right, all the all the evidence would be gone because it become molten, and then it gone. would spew out again and cover the earth. Completely gone. 